Hey everyone, I think it's time to finally make a video on this game. It's been featured on this channel a couple times now, and with its newest content update, I've returned to put more hours into mining for a company that would care less if I make it out alive. Deep Rock has been a game that I've supported since the early access days, and I remember when this game looked like this. After years of hard work and dedication to making a quality product, Ghost Ship Games has created one hell of a game. Most games today are half-assed, and sadly inept publishers aren't afraid to put day one microtransactions in their games rather than make it a memorable experience. Well, I can tell you that Deep Rock Galactic isn't that at all. The folks over at Ghost Ship know how to create an experience and crank that experience to 11. The gameplay loop here is simple. Do the job, get out alive, reap the rewards, and repeat. Having fun comes first and foremost. There's no real stress in this game because you're in control of that aspect too. If you're having a rough day, set your mission to hazard 1 or 2 and relax. Enjoy the procedurally generated level and look out for goodies along the way. If you're feeling kind of warmed up and you want to get into the thick of it, hazard level 3 and 4 should definitely fill that hole in your heart. Or maybe today you woke up and chose violence. Well, hazard level 5 will definitely set you straight. You'll have plenty of bugs to kill. Or, that is until they kill you. But still, no stress. Just go in, earn what you can, kill a hundred bugs, get home just in time to tuck the kids in and kiss the wife goodnight. That is truly why I love this game. It's just fun, always. The fact that I can play any mission and manage to find a complete group of strangers willing to help me is one of the coolest things ever. Usually before I even start a mission, I'll wait for everyone to load in, and I'll do a little dance by the bar, and once everyone's in, I'll buy a round or two before we head out. Rinse and repeat for every lobby that I make. That's the beauty of this game. It doesn't feel like I'm playing with complete strangers, it feels like I'm playing with some brothers of mine. And we're all rocking out with our Glocks out. I bet you thought I was going to say cop. DRG has been one of the best games that I've ever sunk hours into and it thrives on community and offers so much for so little. Customization of your miner and his weapons are one of the many different things to go after in this game. But the game truly opens up once you promote your first class. Then you'll be able to go on deep dives with all your homies and play for the next hour while you struggle to find nitro together. It's a good time, I swear. Anyways, DRG even has a season pass. It literally costs nothing to earn in-game items. It's all free and earnable as you play. I love this, and I wish more companies took notes here. Rewarding players for just playing your game is such a nice incentive to just keep playing. Hell, that's why I keep playing this game on and off for three years now. One of the best parts of this game is the fact that no mission will ever be the same. It's always going to be a different set of caves, different deaths, different environments, and different outcomes. Having so much variety and so much versatility has never been this much fun. I love Deep Rock Galactic so much for what it is on the surface. A cooperative first person shooter with an emphasis on teamwork, killing big bugs, and becoming a badass. Deep Rock Galactic has an extremely positive community of badass gamers, and a passionate group of developers who only have eyes on making your experience one to remember. Do not sleep on this game, buy it now and regret nothing. Anyways, that's going to be it for me today. I hope you enjoyed your stay. My name is Zen, and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.